Dude, he tried to eat the bobber. Did you see that? He tried to eat the freaking bobber. What is up, MFers? I'm freaking jacked right now. We're out here doing some fishing myself and Coleslaw and Huxley the fishing pooch. And we just found this spot with some of the most incredible freaking fish we have ever seen. And the water's pretty clean right here. Um, so we're gonna try to put the, the camera down and show you guys these fish. They are crazy aggressive. We got the little four foot six pole ultralight guy and a little bobber old school bobber fishing with a night crawler are these the most incredible fish you've ever seen cole like definitely the most beautiful dude fish. they're so the colors and markings everything. it's insanity we, we gotta show you guys what we're talking about though we're gonna move back up on this point right here try to get some underwater footage i know we've got some underwater footage of betting largemouth and smallmouth a few weeks ago so definitely if you guys want to see more of that go hit the subscribe button right now but we're gonna put the camera down get underwater cole might even hop in the water a little bit and show you some of these super aggressive fish underwater Drop this little bobber guy down here. Just a little slip bobber rig right on this bed. Watch how fast it is. Boom. Got him. Oh, he came off. That's good. Here's another bed. Cole, can you see these? This is crazy, dude. Look at this guy. Oh, it's just a basic bluegill. See, these are not what we've been catching, guys. These are just, uh, this is just a little bluegill guy right here, but there are so many of these beautiful pumpkin seed. I think they're pumpkin seed, right, Cole? Yeah, pumpkin seed. How funny is this? Freaking Cole right in front of me. Got him. Got him. Dude, I can't believe he doesn't even care that you're standing right there, right by his bed. No. <laughs> Dude, it's broken. I freaking set the hook and my line broke. Oh, Cole wants to see him up close. Here we go. Heads up, Cole. Cole's trying to get some underwater footage of these guys. Oh, I'll take this. Thank you, sir. New crawler. Cole, your crawler was freaking dried. Dude, he tried to eat the bobber. Did you see that? He tried to eat the freaking bobber. Oh, my God. This one is crazy. He doesn't even care that Cole is right next to him. Got it. Boom. Boom. Got him. Yes. Look how freaking beautiful this fish is. God, so much orange. These things are insane. I've never caught fish like this before. Just a simple slip bobber rig and boom. Dude, there's no way this one's going to bite right here by the boat. I bet. Let's try to get him though. Got him. <laughs> Dude, get closer. Get closer. Got him. Got him. You bet. Dude, look at this one. Oh my god, these things are freaking crazy. You want them up there? Alright, I'll toss them to you. Cole wants some artsy shots of him in the water. <laughs> Deal. Here he is, Cole. Does he look good? Does he look pretty? <laughs> Splash run. Oh, we lost him. That's okay. I know where we can catch another one right in front of you. Got him. Did you get that, dude? Oh my god. These things are ridiculous. These are called pumpkin seeds, though, guys. Look at all that blue and orange. Seriously, incredible looking fish. And I've caught them before, but never to this caliber. Cole says he sees one. Yeah. Got him. Got him. Put it in your hand. Deal. Oh my gosh. Look at, dude, look how orange this one is. I'm like tripping out on these right now, guys. They are so freaking beautiful. Just a little night crawler too. Closer. Cole, I'll get over there in a second. Hold on. Let me catch this one first. <laughs> that one's not bad. What do you think? Pretty solid one. All right, Cole thinks we can catch this one right next to him. I feel like he's probably not gonna bite because Cole's camera is in his grill. I can see him. I can see him. Does he got it? He's got it. He's got it. Yes. Yes, dude. Oh my god. This is epic. Incredible, man. Oh, it's cool to come up on a spot like this with all these beds on them and uh, be able to catch this many. This is ridiculous. All right. Another one. And immediately got it. Yes. This is getting ridiculous. Huxley, you like him, bud? What do you guys think? You want to see it? 
I know I do a lot of serious bass fishing videos, but these little freaking pumpkin seeds are incredible. This guy was never, ever coming unhooked. Ever. Huck's getting in. Going for a swim, bud? Get in there, Hux. Go take a look for yourself, bud. <laughs> I'm just going to catch one right over here. Got him. Got him. Got him. Yes. Another one. These seem like giant for pumpkin seed. I know they definitely don't get as big as bluegill, and I don't even know how big these things are. Probably seven inches or so. Not giant, but... God, these beds are everywhere. You can seriously just cast around, boom, another one. Got him. All you gotta do is fire it out there, and it's like almost immediately. And these things are freaking attacking the bobbers. They are so aggressive. Just a simple little tiny jig head with crawler. I'm gonna fire one blind up here. See if I can get one right away. And did. Nope, missed it. Got him. Yep, got him. This is this is the best fishing of all time. I don't care who you are, this is fun. This like totally brings me back to my roots, just out here with slip bobber. Slip bobber and a little freaking piece of worm. Cole's out there trying to get some magic shots. He said he can see some bluegill and stuff. I think we're gonna keep this one actually, because we're actually if you guys watch the next video, we're doing a catch and cook. We went out and caught some giant bluegills. There they are. I think it'd be cool to catch a couple of these guys and see how they they taste compared to some of those big bluegill that we caught. Just basic bluegill. Any over there, Cole? Really? Cole says he sees large-headed bass over there. Maybe we'll have to make our way that way. Just going to keep catching these beautiful guys. Got him. Another one. Another one. Come here, bud. Come here, bud. Look at this one. Freaking bright orange. Dude, this is incredible. This is my favorite thing ever. You guys want to see more of these bluegill fishing videos, please let us know. Hey, Mr. Pontoon Guy. Just catch this fish right next to you. People could literally drive over this spot right now, and we would just continue to catch them. Another one. Yep, yeah, these bigger ones, they are definitely going to get filleted up. I'm, I'm curious to see how they, they taste. I, I felt bad about keeping them at first, but now it's like they're literally all over the place. I don't think we're going to disrupt anything. This is just one spot, too. Come on, come on. You can see his bed, and he got it. Boom. Hopefully you guys can see how how easy this is, just flipping into these fish's beds and just plucking them right off them immediately. Look, Cole. I got one. What do you think? Do you think these are going to taste good, Cole? I bet they will. You guys just going to have to tune in. Next video. Check it out. Guys, thank you so much for taking the time to watch this video. Seeing those fish and how they reacted underwater to our baits was absolutely freaking epic. I can't believe how close we were able to get. It was truly a unique opportunity, and I'm glad we were able to take advantage of it. If you guys want to see more underwater fishing videos, please hit the subscribe button. We have another underwater fishing video coming very soon I want to show you guys. And a huge favor to ask, if you could share this with anyone that likes fishing, or you think they just think it would look cool and want to see those fish underwater, that would be awesome. Go share this with any fisherman in your life. Also, we had some audio issues with this video with one of our mics so sorry if it sounded a little bit funky there we got it all figured out now of course so everything's gonna sound nice and crispy moving forward um, again we, we have a catch and cook with these exact species of fish these pumpkin seeds along with some other giant bluegill and a couple other surprise fish in the next video or the coming videos so be sure to subscribe again you'll be able to see those very very soon but again thank you so much for watching this video I'm I'll catch you very soon out of here